So I am actually a registered lawyer for those of you who don't know. Not my choice. Um, but yeah, basically my subscribers are wild. So I'm going to be reading your guys' craziest confessions. Let's get in with it. Confession number one. Okay, so basically, I have an amazing best friend. We've been friends for a really long time, so keep in mind she also has a twin brother who I think, or who I had the biggest crush on. So basically, sophomore year of high school, she was doing her figure skating routine and got a really bad injury on her leg. So she had surgery, and her twin brother came to pick me up so he could go visit her mind. Mind you, I'm also friends with her twin brother, but anyways... I remember we had some really good conversations on the way there and then we got to the hospital and I stayed there and visited her until about 11 p.m. and then she drove us all home to her house. Okay, this is a pretty long one by the way. We were all hanging out watching a movie and then we ended up telling stories and she mentioned how it was annoying that people only wanted to be friends with her to get with her brother. Me knowing that I have a crush on this kid, I felt awful and I was scared it was going to ruin our friendship. So you know, I was just like, you know, you know what, maybe I'll ignore the crush on him. Like, I, like I'll just get over it. But anyways, we ended up falling asleep and we woke up the next morning and had breakfast. And when I went home, obviously my friend couldn't drive me home and I didn't have my car. So her brother ended up driving me home, no big deal. He dropped me off and hugged me goodbye. He's not really the physical touch type of person, so it was already different, but my simp butt was like, OMG, but basically the day was really chill, and the next day at school, he was around me a lot, being very clingy and huggy. This continued for a good month, and then me, my friend, and her brother went to hang out. Well, we were all sitting on a park bench, and then she goes, oh, I have to use the bathroom. So it left me with her and her brother. Well, he confessed to liking me for five years. I was so dumbfounded and I obviously said yes because ah, but uh, we didn't tell my friend until after five months. Luckily she wasn't mad, thank goodness, but we are still close. So now I'm in my senior year and yeah. So basically what you're trying to tell me is that you're just really real. Best friend's brother. Like is it too trope? Is it too niche? Yes. But you ate that up. It's a bonus. And not you pulling him after like everyone wanted him. That's what I'm gagged about. Cause this is like, no, I'm gagged to be honest. I'm, like, I'm taking your side. Like you see a hottie, you want a hottie. Like, none of my friends have ever had like hot brothers. But if they did like girl, I'd be doing the same. <laughs> Why is this kind of even Wattpad? No, because like something about it, something about that best friend's brother. And also not him confessing, because I love old men. Because like where are they at? You get me? That, that was real. Okay. Next one. I destroyed a relationship on purpose. Don't worry, they were both bad people, lol. So... To be honest, like, because you said they're both bad people and you're my subscriber, like, I'm 100% fully taking your side on this. Um, you're real for that and I love that for you. Like, I know you, f I know you, like, went to bed smirking that night. Like, I, I just know. I just know. I know you guys too well. Alright. Next one. A couple months ago, I took alcohol from my grandparents and I've always been seen as the good child. So, they obviously didn't think it was me and my older brother took the blame for it and no one knows it was me still. For the sake of the story and YouTube, we'll say I'm 21, of course. So you took alcohol from your grandparents, but did you drink the alcohol? Did you drink the alcohol? So... Oh my god, it's a crime, I forgot. <laughs> you guys. No alcohol here. Don't drink alcohol. But low-key, like, your brother's so real. Can we just, like, everyone, I'm, just, I'm sending this down. Honestly, thank you to your brother. Like, if your brother's watching this, wait, bring this video to your brother really quick. I just want to say, uh, your sister uh, was the one who stole the alcohol, which you probably knew because you're smart. But thank you for your service, and I love that for you because siblings are great like that. Like, I love siblings like that. Honestly, I have a really nice older brother too, so I relate to that. Anyway, leave a like for him. Not to boost my video or anything, but just leave a like for him. Yeah. <sighs> Last one. Well, if you really want it, before I go to bed, I look up Bang Chan and Changbin muscle pics and listen to Drive and Red Lights on Loop. 
Goofy, I know. Lol. I'm gonna be honest, like, we're all the same. Guys, when I close my eyes, all I see is real lights, real lights, real lights. You guys are so like me. Like, I honestly, because like other people, like, I can never publicly admit this at school, but like, you guys are just like me. Like, stop. I'm so happy right now because, like, you know how like you meet people and you're like you're just as weird as me and i literally love you for that like thank you for being weird i'm tired of all these like like everyone's so perfect nowadays like can we all just admit that we're weird thank you <laughs> the fact that like my classmates may eventually find this video um i just want to say everything i just said was only for the sake of appearing relatable to my viewers and not because i actually do those things not at all Anyway, that's all. Short video, but my storage is gonna run out, to be honest. That was crazy, you guys. These videos are so fun to make, I'm not even gonna lie. So like, if you have more of these, like, put them down below. Um, uh, I couldn't post last week because I was like busy with homework. Uh, so much testing going on. But yeah, thanks for watching.